Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. So today we're gonna be making a seafood boil. I'm finally in my kitchen making some food content for you guys. It was highly requested by you guys and yeah, if you guys like this video, I'll try it and do some more for sure. I've been making this for like, a I've been making it a few times now guys. It's just like, I think seafood boil is like my favorite dish. It just warms my heart up, it warms my belly up, it fills you up and it's actually quite easy to make believe it or not so just make sure you get good quality seafood so i do follow a recipe online but i just take like guidance from it i don't follow it to to the exact measurements but i would definitely recommend using it because yeah it's just worked so far and i think i should follow it a bit more because last time i did it i kind of messed up and i didn't have enough paprika but yeah let's go through the ingredients okay so obviously you're gonna need your fresh seafood so i've got some lobster and i think about like six king jumbo prawns in there and then you're gonna also need some garlic onion of course some lemon i use the gnaw like uh, chicken stock it comes like this you can use the cubes as well it's the same thing but i really like these ones you're gonna need some butter i like to use the uh president unsalted version then um some sweet corn of course and then for seasoning you're going to need some bay leaves some crushed chilies paprika which is key and some cayenne and this is what gives it the nice kick guys i love it super spicy excuse me can schwartz sponsor me please thank you very much <laughs> Okay, so the first thing that I start with, obviously make sure to clean your seafood really well. And we're gonna start cutting the onion. I'm really bad at cutting onion. And I hate these knives. So with the onion, you just wanna cut it or dice it really. Apparently if you keep the tail on, so like the tail of the onion on, usually I cut it off. It doesn't make you cry and it's so, it makes cutting it so much easier. This table is kind of high for me, so I'm like, <laughs> I'm gonna, I don't want to cut my finger. Make sure to comment below what dishes you want me to try and make. Honestly, guys, sorry if I look funny. I've had this makeup on for a few hours now. Now we're going to take some garlic, three or four. You want a good amount of garlic. What I like to do is crush them first. I might need to refresh my memory on the recipe. Cause last time I just didn't do it right. You know, you know when you just know it's, it doesn't taste like it usually does. And this recipe is good. Right, and then you wanna take your garlic crusher thingy. I'm gonna just crush these. I'm actually hungry. What did I have for lunch today? I don't even know, what did I have? Oh, I had burrata and bread. Mm. Guys, have you tried burrata with bread? It's like so good with like a bit of olive oil and some salt and pepper. So bomb. My question to you guys is, have you got one of these garlic crushers? Cause they're so handy. I'll say that's a good amount of garlic, bit of it. It's starting to burn my ass. Guys, the onion makes me cry. You know, with this recipe, it does have a lot of butter. It's not the healthiest thing out there, but yeah, you do need a lot of butter. You would need this whole block really, and that's a lot of butter for me, but it's just worth it in the end. Um, I think I'm just gonna cut the lemon now, so I don't have to bother with that they are. And then yeah, we can start cooking. Okay, so you want to get your large pan out. I'm gonna get a good stick of butter and then a bit of olive oil and we're gonna put the onions in where's my sizzling i hate it when the sizzling sound doesn't come okay then i'm gonna put in the garlic make sure you don't burn it just leave that for like a minute oh i love the smell of garlic and onion cooking then you want to put the lemon juice Then I'm gonna put some bay leaves in there. Three tablespoons of paprika. Just put a little bit more. One tablespoon of cayenne. And 
one tablespoon of chili flakes. We're just gonna give that a nice mix. Just let the, the spices cook quickly. I've got that heat on like medium. You wanna add kind of like three sticks of butter like this. And then that's just gonna melt in there. And then in the meantime, I'm just going to uh, heat some, well, boil some water. I'm just mixing the stock water now. I'm gonna add the stock to the butter. Cook. Okay, now I'm gonna put the sweet corn to boil. I'm just gonna go in there for eight minutes. Oh my god, I feel like I'm multitasking to the max. I hate doing this. Okay, these can turn around now. Ideally, you do not use your hands, but. My forceps are in the sink, so I can't bother to clean it. Okay, so that's going to cook for another 3.5 minutes, I would say. It smells amazing. The prawns are ready. I'm going to cook the lobster now. That literally goes in for five minutes. put the timer on and yeah that's the last thing and then literally when everything's done you just put it in the sauce give it a little simmer but yeah i'm gonna do a quick tidy up right so i've literally put everything in the sauce i accidentally uh splattered the sauce everywhere but yeah just give this a good mix usually i put extra mussels and um prawns or i would get like two packs of the prawns but i just didn't have it but yeah, that is it really. Obviously, it's like proper hot right now, but that is the finished result. It's bomb. I definitely recommend you guys trying it out. Um, I think I might save like a mukbang for another day because um, I feel like I need more and maybe like ask you guys to ask me questions so we can do like a mukbang Q&A. Um, so yeah, make sure to let me know in the comments below if you would like that. But definitely try out this recipe. I'll leave the ingredients and the recipe that I use for reference in the info box. Let me know how you find it. And I'm going to go enjoy this with a movie. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, give this video a like, and I will see you next time. Bye.